So I'm finally getting to play some golf. Gonna go check out one of my absolute favorite places in the state of Maine. This is the Aroostook River in Fort Fairfield, Maine. Back in the 1800s, this was the original border between the United States and Canada. And we're gonna go play one of the best hidden gems in the area. It's nestled back behind this mountain over here. You'll see in a second. But if you're into history, like I am, you should check out kind of the history of this area as we are basically in what used to be Canada and we're going to a course uh, that half is in the United States, half is in Canada. And I don't know that there's anywhere else in the world where something like this exists. And I can guarantee you that in 2021, when you have your passport, you're going to want to make a trip up here. Snow finally melts up here. That red cabin over there, if you're an early riser, you could rent this and literally be the first person to see the sunrise in the United States in the summertime. A truly international golfing experience. This hole is one of their signature holes, the International. Half is in the United States, half is in Canada. Here we go. Of course, it's looking strong. He was right. Then you come along here and you see these things. See? We really are in Canada. I think you can see that. Yeah. All right, I found my ball. I hit it over here somewhere. at the beautiful Aroostook Valley Country Club, one of my favorite holes in all of New England. You see over there, that's a potato field, and this hole is very challenging. It's a dog leg left, 510 yards from the whites, 530 from the blues. You really got to kind of position the ball at the bottom of the hill. I'm over here now. I'm trying to figure out what we want to do here. Do I tin cup it and go for it or lay up before the water? The story of this place goes all the way back to Prohibition. And a bunch of farmers up in the area were upset that they couldn't drink. Like most of us would probably be upset in days like today. And so they decided to build a golf course that's in Canada and the parking lot is in the United States. So this is literally probably one of the only places in the world that is a true international golfing experience. And it is looking amazing right now. I just talked to their pro, Steven. He's been here for over 20 years and he says, by far this year, it looks the best. So even though we've had to wait, it's gonna be well worth it. And you need to make sure to check it out. This place has to be on your list for this summer. And by the way, they are running an incredible special right now. And I wanted you to let it let you know about it. Um, they would really appreciate your business. As soon as the governor can list, list, lift this um, county by county restriction, they are offering 10 rounds of 18 in a cart for $400 Canadian, which if you know anything about the currencies right now is probably the deal of the century so make sure to put the Aroostook Valley Country Club on your list this summer I plan to play a 10 I just bought a pass and I'm probably gonna buy another one and I think you should too thanks so much for watching this episode of golfing with Sean uh, if you liked it please make sure to subscribe to our page and check it out for more videos uh, and really exciting things that we have coming to promote golf in New England and to introduce you, me, and everybody that's interested into a new community that is 
centered around promoting golf in the region and creating new friendships and professional relationships. And we hope that you will take the time to like the New England Golf Passport page. And I can't wait to see you next time where we play the beautiful Mars Hill. But it's gonna say New England instead of Nebraska. That's where this was founded. It's gonna be the best way to experience golf and actually the uh, things associated with golf, such as greatest restaurants and um, just meeting new friends. It's gonna be called the New England Golf Passport. And uh, we hope you can take some time to uh, join our email newsletter because that'll give you first uh, rights to uh, uh, get access to this, but it'll also give you access to uh, more news.